Now people check this out, it's a carnival time here in Jamaica again and people when I sound so excited, I am so excited to tell you that I don't know nothing about carnival, in fact I've never been to carnival and I would never go to carnival because I don't think people dressing like that and dancing in the streets, it kind of look like some form of ritual to me and it's just not my thing but if it is your thing, it is your thing but guess what? I know so I'm going to bash me when I say this, but I know the people in Mugga Carnival now come talk the truth, but I'm going to talk to you So today, right? I'm going to say 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 Jesus Christ! You boss think I shit, 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 not just that. Not just that. Yes, when your friend them will come back at him, when we, we, we walk back at him, the, the shit scent will lick me, brother. May I tell us that the shit scent stand up there and I can't leave all that. It think it think it think it think it Brother, I don't know why and it's not another the first time I see this. Yes, if I got the same thing too. I got one soccer a party and one of them wine for me and then I live a dude who smell like furious and it. I mean, never shit at myself. I don't know what but I can't be alone this happened to you. No, I, I, no, I got class, me, but no, sir. Fuck you, boy. No, people, you know what? <laughs> I don't know what to say about the dude, the man, them. You see it? That is the reason why I do not find this carnival thing attractive. You know, carnival is mostly like the uptown people, them. Yeah, man, I feel them type of thing that and certain type of society type of people and some other set of people, which is not really my set of people where I kind of associate myself with, if you know exactly what I mean. But <laughs> what she said, people, you know what? What is up? I got my answer to family. Hope each and every one of you is having a blessed and productive day. And people, as usual, do remember to give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, and make we kick the video off like this. Now people check this out, popular social media personality, or should I say the infamous Ivani, Ivani Wright, who is mostly known in Jamaica for hacking people accounts, being in back and forth arguments online with other people, and also I think Ivani was shot and imprisoned here in Jamaica, and she is known to par with celebrities like Tamali Sparta among others, and also appearing in a lot of music videos, so you know that Ivani is well popular, well people, what what Ivani did was she actually went to Mexico and crossed the border and now she's within the United States seeking asylum. Now people, within that time Ivani actually got pregnant so a lot of going for Ivani and now she's also a popular TikToker. But what happened is that Ivan is now in lockup because of an incident stemming with her same baby father. I don't really remember the issue i think it's some form of payment issue and a next chart from somebody else that uh, she actually stabbed up the person no people i don't know how true this is but i know that she is actually in lockup but people the big thing about it is that the immigration the, the i think the immigration for the united states wants ivani as she come out of lock up, yeah man, immigration I go wall on panar. So you know say that are some immigration related issues. Now you're in a next country and I am thinking you're seeking asylum but you're now in lock up for <laughs> This is totally crazy. You think say America and Jamaica is the same thing if them lock you up in a Jamaica. What you feel like them are gonna do with you in America? Now people she is now facing being actually being deported to Jamaica and she has a child that is American. So you know what people take a listen to this. Vani Mega a two things we have to say to you. Some I you know gonna like some I gonna like. You understand what I say? Vani is in America. When tell you are an immigrant, I'll know even though I have green card in me, I'm an immigrant. You know. Yes, you know what I say? So tell you are an immigrant, yes, sir. You have a bill. You understand what I say? You, you might feel like, say, yo, them tell you, say, you have a same right like a young kid, man. You can tour to tour with a young kid, man. I feel them place this. You hear me, I tell you? You see, one time the law forward, I see you. I see one Yankee, they are going to listen to it too, you know. But they are going to listen to the Yankee. 
You yeah, want him grant, you know, man. You yeah, understand me? You see certain way how you see Yankee move, yes, sir. We don't have that the spectacularly. You yeah, understand me? Ask anybody with the America. We still walk like we're up on a thin line. You see, all we do, we have that little green key out there in our wallet. And we have that little sitting there in a house. You have to walk on a thin line in America as an immigrant. You understand me? No matter how them tell us, you have freedom, yes, sir. And freedom, this so. And if you go rare, you can't do You can't do it, mama. You see how you live on the internet? Mama! <laughs> you, 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 you seem like you have a green card, man. A 10 year green card. Permanent resident. You understand me? I say, call police when you feel like. And you think you can't just have good on there. And you rare, and you. Bro! A lot you tell them, you don't know, have the same blood clot sentiment like a Yankee then. You hear me I tell you, bro? You see them, police in America will friend you up and make you think say everything good. Social worker, judge, all of them, they friend you up, they send you a prison. Remember that, me can tell you. You see, in America, when time you had, nobody thinks none of them are your friend. Social worker, Police, none of them are your friend. You got blood clot, jail. Especially knowing say you are immigrant. They ready to lock you up and chew away the blood clot key. Me did that immigration jail, you know. Thirty day, all heap of money and big liar get you out of that. Me have the best liar in Florida. That alone me can help you with. Me can give you the best liar to make you can walk a road again. Me can't do that for you. To cost your money doing a man. It will cost your money. If you reach in a predicament where you and America immigration are in a problem, you're going to need that lady when you're Sophia. Me can't bust up on Sophia. You understand me? I deal with. But you see, in this country, Avani, immigration is not play, brother. The law is not ramp, yes, sir. Then sit down and build keys for your senior, your blood clot yard. All people with green key are then send one van me. I tell you that. You see when they hold you like a sobra, then send one all people with green key. Yard. All people get citizenship up at this get blood clot. Send one of them blood clot yard, me G. You see me? Cause the country, you might feel like it with you in a van. Feel like it with you. You feel like them with you. Oh, yo, we got your back. Oh, this a country and I got nobody back. And you did have a bad mind, man, where you're there with. This a little boy where you're there with, where you breed for. This a little youth and a rate you. The youth see you with your clout. Him running for you. And he, 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 he just want the TikTok fear, man. He just love you all over the page. And I saw them stay. Man are like bitches too. Them run down the hype. And him come and he, 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 he have all kind of screenshot with you. Have all kind of evidence. Say you mad. Say you we hurt this. Remember now, you know. These people sit down and manipulate you. And watch you do everything where you are. Just so they can send you where you are going. You see me? One time you, see say, did I reach yes or with Oh, you should have just... Try to find the most peaceful way to deal with this, bro. No one say you are an immigrant. Remember, you know, me not say you're not right, you know. But find your theme place this. Who you think them are going to the, go take over? Them are going to take theme side. And worse, you're forward with someone sitting and then you're an immigrant and rare. You should have find a better way to deal with your baby father with this little baby thing. Yeah. You understand me? No, you're not jail. No, you're not jail. I'm not going to say she is a victim, you know. But you have to be careful what you do on the internet, Vani. I tell you that. You see, this year, I want to make a quote. My, my lawyer tell me that. Say, all of the immigration judges, they watch me vlog them. The, the prosecution watch me vlog them. They know what I do. The morning when I go in a court, they call me Pretty Dan, bro. She said, Good morning, Pretty Dan. We got a famous one, huh? Me I tell you, 
Them watch that, them have all of that. You see, there's something away near the internet. Everything away was set on here already and do on here already. They have it, bro. And them have it. Me couldn't even believe when they called me pretty than the morning. So watch your vlogs. All of them understand your, your Jamaican dialect. Them dead, they don't get it. Them are people that translate to them. You have Jamaicans are working on immigration. You understand what I deal with? So as I tell you, you know, bro, is that we can't run up and down in this country like we feel like, say, yo, we and them people are born here. Yeah. We not see a predicament. We don't. Right you now, I feel sad. If you know, see you there in a jail and the whole like, Jamaican they kind of bring you down in our way, bro. Because we are Jamaicans, we live in America. We are immigrants all away. We're not supposed to be glad. You see, when he, he, no kind of. You see me, immigrant of Jamaican descent in a no kind of police problem. You understand me, I say? And them look a thing that you go a, a follow up the brother, you follow up the brother, you settle him, send you a prison, bro. Yeah, I did. Did you enjoy yourself? I did. Yeah. You did? I did. This is my baby, okay? This I'm is my baby, yeah. I'm I know people just to inform everyone that this is actually a re-upload well this segment that is coming up is actually a re-upload because i had some issues yesterday after the video got quite amount of views and i had to take it down and do some corrections to it so people if you watch it already you don't have to watch it again but if not take a look at this Serpy, Serpy, are you me come for address can we get the final out say you as a youtuber you are trying to paint a narrative like you are against crime and violence in a Jamaica and you are helping eradicate crime and violence in Jamaica. When in actuality you are doing the opposite. You are actually causing crime and violence in Jamaica. You are causing turf war. You are causing family for pre-family. You are causing wally for shooting and killing in a Jamaica. Because you, are, you don't get your facts them straight. You go off a ear set. Tool to people. Send two message to your inbox and you come out come talk like you did dead, like you have evidence. You now come out come talk like it's an allegation. You get to me, I say, and oh, me prove this. Me hear you talk about one youth, one little youth, you drop out in a hundred. See? When the youth drop out, then post up a picture with the youth. The youth have a prop gun, basically a plastic gun, because them that showed music video the day in a hundred. And the youth somehow take up the gun and take a picture with it. And people when I like the youth post up the picture. We said the youth did involve in a crime and violence. And the youth never shoot a fly from him born. The youth did not involve in a no crime. A youth me know personally. You get to me I say? Alright. Next thing again. Me hear you talk about mad cabra. And say mad crabber now come back a road. And when me look me see mad crabber come back a road in no time. You say squash now come back a road, squash come back a road in no time. Then me see I talk about Tommy Thompson, bright light. Bright light is like a father to me. Bright light and me, and me bridging. See, me and the man they do business together, music business together, par with bright light, up and down. See, them man there, where you try to bring cross, pan them man there, say them man they burn body and I do them thing, they make lizard miss now and them something there. Not no go like what you say. The man they don't own a cremator. You get to me, I say, so you need to get your facts straight. People try to mix up cartel and bright light in the lizard case because bright light and cartel used to do a lot of business together, a lot of shows in the last part before cartel go to jail. You get to me, I say, before cartel get locked up, bright light and cartel did do a lot of show because I used to do bright light. You get to me, I say, you, Sir P, people come in your inbox and I tell you things. And you come out and I talk like you did dead, like you're you deaf on the scene. You now come out and I say, Ear say, you cause enough innocent youth for dead. You cause enough war for you go on in the country, brother. If you don't get your facts them straight, brother, I bet you don't say nothing. No, people, that was a popular dance and artist Anima City causing a bit of Anima City on popular YouTuber Surfy from Politics Watch, stating that based on the content or the context 
of Serpice video, he may cause a lot of Jamaicans to lose them life, stating that he must state information as if he was actually there and sometimes he has misleading information and it has set up a lot of people life. So people, do you share the same opinion as Anna City? Let me know in the comment section or do you think that Serpice is actually doing a good job? Tell a break out. Cartel are going to do a jailbreak right now if the Privy Council say no. I tell you this tears, tell you know. You fool. You are my artist, my general, but you fool. I'm going to bribe you all of them blood clad, licky licky blood clad water that they were Jamaica have. I make them broke me out and that time I'm going to send kids. You understand what you're doing? Stop playing with me. If me a voice can tell you, I'm not doing do a level years and a prison. With the heap of money they were me having a close. Eh? When me done put a blood clot red together, me I met them and say, what you know? Two million right now, I scratch me you now. All I know if you do, you know, I just make me turn up missing, you know. And all, and all say me dead, you know. Bury me round a back round, so, you know. And me there send kids are easy, you know. You see me, I say, yeah, man, we can't believe your blood clot make them lock you up for so long. Me now nah, have so much million. You rather the millions of your freedom, you madman, more than bin break out, more than call. Bro, me must say, bro, God, that's the easiest thing for bribing. All you have to do is make you associate them call, bro, God, and say, your bro, God, never be so fool. That scratch me. You know they love money. I'm money running labor right there, me no man. Call him! I say, yo, me have a piece of money and scratch me, no, bro, God. One, four or five million, so, you know. Where you say, can't go on? For your shackles. I want to tear your blood clot, idiot. God tell you never want to come on. But privy council will let you out this week. Me now go come on your first show. Because I say me clock me claustrophobic. And if so much people they around me a ten feet more. And if one blood clot for us, somebody may smell me obelious. No people, that person needs no introduction. That was a popular social media personality, Pretty Dan, stating that incarcerated dancer superstar Vibes Cartel should actually plan a prison break. So he's stating that because Vibes Cartel is obviously rich, Vibes Cartel should just pay off some wadi and plan a prison break, go to some small Caribbean country and have his millions and live happily ever after. Well, that is in the fairy tale world. Then again, people, Pretty Dan is suggesting that, you know, Vibes Cartel could have buy out Brogard, which is the Prime Minister of Jamaica, the most honorable Andrew Olness, stating that Andrew Olness love money. Now, people, that is what Pretty Dan is saying. Do you think that is a good idea at this point? <laughs> now, people, come on, man. You know, I'm just a joke. You know, I'm just joking around. Of course not. That's a, that a nonsense. Any of people, we are talking about the same pretty Dan where uh, do things like this, so. You want me? You want me to bubble? You want me? You want me to bubble like me in a chair? You want me to skin out? You want me to broke it down? If you're Jamaican, stop. I want you to name one person who you'd never be caught dead arguing with, especially on the internet where other people can't see you, and tell me why the person name we call named Pretty Dan. Is this what serves and protect me? Him, him there, cut a bag of bag of that for me. So I make sure some lawyer get what them need to get. Yes, man, because me there, me there, and me simply explain my situation. And I be a bad old man across for me. And I'm just cooperating. I me, me can't understand. Plus, she over here, so be an attitude and all that. So. Now, people, in this scenario, I was not there. I did not see the entire video and I don't know what happened. But this man is suggesting that the police were behaving in a total different way. Be a bad word, them I tell him. And people, I have first hand seen police react like that before. Just for a simple offense, me see them bad up man and tell man how much bad word. I don't want to, and when them and them start video, you see them, 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 them drying at themselves because they don't want to be posted on the social media and they don't want to be reported to their, uh, probably their superintendent, whatever the case may be, or their department or whatever it should be. But uh, some of these police officers, you definitely cannot trust them. Them lie, then lie, then lie, then deal with your wicked. Then deal with you like them above the law, like said them are God. And people are not joking. I'm not saying that all police officers do that, but I have seen it in more than one cases where police abused, totally abused their authority to a citizen that was actually complying. And then again, you have some citizens, of course, them give the, the police them problems. So 
I mean, like, uh, the, the, the police them, I would more give the police them the wrong because this is your job. This is your profession. And citizens, you're going to have all type of citizens. You're going to have people with mental illness. You're going to have people that just just totally rude. And then you're going to have law-abiding and decent citizens. So you have to know how to deal with people on a general note. People, I like me yourself. Talk to me in the comment section. Brother, yes, I'm tell, me not tell you already. Before I come to America, bro. But they are Jamaica three days before I left Jamaica and drive one van go over Central Village. Me never forget, bro. And the police then hold me. Three police hold me. Three. Power and lonely road. Me just let out my dog man in Ghana my yard. And the boy then check the vehicle where I drive. And then realize how far vehicle me I drive. Hey boy, them are, one of them come out and go over one bush over one shady place so off a roadside. And the rest of the police them come so boom. And have me at the jeep, stand up with the man and say to me, say, yo, my dad, come out of son, man. Go on over there so we squad with the man. And I ah, me up, oh, me there right just over a jeep there. I look from blood clad, squad over there, so squad set up. I saw squad here bite up in lip. Remember, we got to do this. We know when boy go, when people are dead. And we know when man want to kill people. But we know when he want to kill me, innocent. So he might feel tough up himself because he might not kill her. Now for them police boy, they ain't no killer, yo. Them just make them friend tell them to do things. And the boy come out and go over there and I say, yo, come over here, man, and the next time I say, go over there. And I say, go over where I kill you, no one and kill me. A God send one woman, three days before I left Jamaica for come America. A God send one woman, and when the woman come and see me, I say, mommy, don't let me, please. Anywhere you want to go in the world, me will eat you. But don't let me, they're going to kill me right here, so please. Said so, said done. The woman say no, nah, I left me. And I saw the police boy. I tell you that, brother. You hear that? And I like police, dog. You see, Pum Pum? Pum Pum are going to be the demise of so much man. You see, crutches? Crutches are going to lead some man astray. Them don't even know it yet. Them don't even know it yet. If something's supposed to happen to you, who really are going to for you? You can't fuck 10,000 girl right now. You can't have one a country, one a town, and all two in a foreign right, right, right now. But if something's supposed to happen to you, and you can't run the phone span, the girls them anymore, will they really come and sit down beside your hospital bed? Will they really make sure, say, when you get discharged from the hospital, you yeah, go home to a comfortable bed for lie down pan if you're in a pain or if you're sick or if you don't even feel good. Then I'm make sure you eat. Let me know. Now, people, I found this video very interesting of this female stating that Pum Pum, and we all know what Pum Pum is. Pum Pum is going to be the downfall of many men. And then, people, thinking about it, she's talking like, isn't Pum Pum already the downfall of many men? Because a whole heap of bad man use woman for draw out money now, and then go slap them away, if you know exactly what I mean. Enough time, woman set up man, and them use them Pum Pum, of course. <laughs> But people, you know, I've heard somebody said something like this. A man come out and want pum pum and he spend him entire life a try to go back in a that pum pum. Although some man a try to go back in a something else, but you know exactly what I mean. <laughs> Anyhow, people, I am going to leave you with this video. I found it really interesting of this man. He actually lives off the grid. Like, the man have solar, live off the grid. Him have natural water at his disposal. Him not pay no electricity bill, no water bill. And him have him good internet connection. Would you live like this? People, let's take a look at this. Yeah, man, some people want to know why I'm going off grid. Why I got half grid? I get a loan. Could I buy a house? Could I buy a scheme house? Scheme house have to maintain them year 30, 35 years for pay for it. You see me light water, internet and have to pay. I depend on the half grid here. I have fresh spring water down the road when I can collect. You see me rainfall, I can do rainwater harvesting. I have solar panel on top of my house to give me electricity. So when time I pay for the light and light gone, and I still have to pay for them services. Water gone. And I still have to pay for them services. Internet gone for all a week or two. You see me? Yeah. I don't have that problem there. Only bill I have right now is an internet bill. And it's not cable and wireless or flu or where they want you. Digital. Yeah. None of them one day. <laughs> you see me? But they're off the grid. Right now, I'm seeing how I plant in farm. I just come from. Boom. Cut this. 
any, any of this, this tea out there, but like at least a day more a bird I start eating. More the food I have. More time I go me after I go in there and I say, yo, you see me? So we can grow my own food. You see me? I have less expenses. I have less nice on my years. And the neighbor next door I make up no loud nice or this no that no re re re. The the year cleaner down here. It was more peaceful. Listen. Birds are chirp. What what yeah, yeah tell me say you don't want that in our life? Isn't it? Yeah man. And right you now if I'm not even fully stuck yet. Wait till all uh, give me like what I say another year and a half when everything starts mature up the right way and I go say farming. You see me? Eat food off of farming and less spending. You see me that I one of the thing too. I know that's another system. I spend money every month, twenty or thousand pound light bill, and then I now cost them, and then I go in the right service. Now, you see me, so don't, me can't bother with them things. Some of us come out here and listen to nature. Yeah, man, I'm gonna chop things off of my tree. Perhaps I'm planning, you know, soon later.